Good afternoon, everybody. It's uh, 4.18 on uh, Tuesday. Um, well, we had us a DOT. I told you, told you, and told you. Down south, it ain't like up here. You know, it ain't like up here at all. So we've actually made, uh, it looks like our little accident's gone, what do you call it, viral or video or whatever. They saw kind of... Somebody behind us, I guess, took all the pictures and then sent it all across the whole world. So everybody's seeing uh, DART uh, going from one side of the interstate to the other side of 65 to then starts coming around and then going sideways right across and going up on the, uh, I can't, but thank God, the uh, 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 embankment, the, the, the guardrail between the northbound and the southbound 65, that's where our tractor ended up on top of that, and the trailer jackknifed on around. Thank goodness the trailer wasn't damaged. Uh, we got it got it all done. The trailer's on a very, very uh, shaky customer, extremely good customer, a customer that, that uh, pays a lot of money, but we've been on, uh, we've been on uh, the real bad list with those guys because we can't deliver on time. So I advised them myself personally that we, we had an accident and we, we do have it now recovered and going to deliver. But, uh, you know, uh, hey, guys and girls, this happens to be a female. That's normally, usually I don't have to, to, to uh, uh, you know, too much get involved with that part of it because usually they don't, uh, they, this one was not driving, obviously. The speed limit on 65 in Alabama would be probably, I think it's 70 miles an hour, so, or 65 or 70. But I mean, you know, we, the whole road is white, and uh, I don't care if anybody else is driving fast. It doesn't matter to me, but, uh, you know, so we're cruising at 55, which is way faster than the road conditions, over and out. It is, you know, it's too fast for road conditions when you're talking about you know, ice, snow, sleet, and down there, what happened is, uh, you got sleet started last night, and just a little snow, but it froze. I mean, this the freezing rain and sleet freezes, and again, you know, uh, up here they got all kind of crap to clean these roads, but they sure don't down there. So, um, and the and it's and it basically everything is still shut down. Memphis, all the way across Chattanooga, I mean, it's just bad, and uh, so. All I can tell you to do is if you are driving and the interstates are open, they did close down for a while, I think they may be open, hey, drive under control. You know, have your unit under control. And, and in this case, this was a load of uh, insulation. So obviously you're running uh, 17,000, so you don't have a lot of weight on your trailer either. So you... Uh, uh, you know, you t tend to spin, and once you start, once you start to slide, it's it's. Um, I don't know. It's just uh, I feel sorry for the person, the driver here, because uh, uh, there ain't no doubt uh, this person had to be because they've got they went a couple of hundred yards going from left side to right side, just perfectly sliding like you're ice skating, you know, one side to the other side. So. And then finally came around and came to a rest. So it's just dangerous, man. You can't control it when you're on this kind of sheet of ice. It's 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 non controllable. So um just we've gotta go slow. We gotta get through this. We didn't we don't need a DOT. We didn't need one. This will be our first one this year. So thank God it was not just it was just us. It wasn't another vehicle involved. Um other than that, uh God, I mean, you know, the weather's the the top the top uh the top deal. I mean, it is the top, top, uh, top deal of the day. Um, we've just got to, we got to just keep it going. So we'll work through it. Uh, that's just what we got to do. So uh, I don't have a whole lot else to go over. I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. I love y'all. And uh, text me if you need me. Bye.